Hey guys, I'm Alex with Kind of Pro Video Tutorials. Today I'm going to show you how to do your own custom lens flare type film burn. Um, it's not really a film burn because we're not actually using film, but it is more of a lens flare because we're using light reflecting off the lens. Um, by doing your own custom lens flare, you don't have to deal with usage rights, pulling from YouTube, and you can kind of create your own stylistic look for your video clip you're editing. Um, it's pretty simple, so let's get started. The first thing we're going to need is a flashlight or a headlamp. I really like this one because it changes colors and I really like the, the red LED. It creates a really nice stylistic lens flare. Uh, you're going to need a lens, of course. Uh, we're going to use a 55 today so it's not too wide and can give us um, a nice angle at the light in the lens. You're going to want to go into a dark space so uh, there's no other light shining through but the one you're using. And we're going to go ahead and start just shining our light into our lens. Um, Try a few different things here, have some fun with it, and uh, kind of try and rub the corners of the lens, try and get some cool looks going here. Uh, try not to get the physical flashlight in the shot, unless that's the look you're going for. Um, it could look kind of cool at some points. Um, but yeah, just kind of, like I said, rub the corners and, and really try and make uh, some cool flashing looks that you're going to add to whatever clip uh, we're going to be editing later. So once you have everything imported, um, pick a clip you're going to throw this lens flare onto. Um, I chose this snowboarding shot of me with the GoPro. Um, these lens flares and film burns tend to look really nice with skate films and snowboard films, so that's what we're going to be using today. Um, I'm not going to use the, the white one we shot because I, I don't think it's going to work too well with the snow. Um, so we're going to pick a section of the, the red shining into the lens um, for this lens flare. Um, you know, choose wisely. There's going to be a lot that you're going to be messing with, so just pick a nice little, you know, four second section uh, that you want to throw on top and just experiment with it. So, um, yeah, I picked the clip too long here, so I'm going to kind of cut it a little bit, and you know, I'm not really looking too hard as what to the, as what the lens flare looked like, but. Um, so once you have this over the clip that you're going to be using, um, you're going to go ahead and play it and just see that you'll have your main clip and then all of a sudden you won't see it anymore because your lens flare clip is above it. Um, now to just let the, the light shine through, what you're going to do is you're going to click the clip, the lens flare clip, and then you're going to go on down to your compositing and select, uh, you're going to select screen. So once it's screened, you can actually see now that the lens flare is showing through and uh, you're not seeing any black on the screen anymore. So as you can see it worked pretty well. Um, I like how this looks. Um, you know, and you can really mess with this. You can mess with the opacity of the lens flare. You can, you can mess with different colors of light. I mean you can really get creative with these and uh, throw them into edits here and there. And, make them kind of just subtle stylistic changes to your edits um, and they tend to look really nice. Like I said, I'm not going to use the white here just because I don't think it's going to look too good with the snow, but on a darker shot maybe that a, a white light would look better. Um, so yeah, just have some fun with these and uh, really explore your lens flare film burn creativity. There you have it, pretty fun and easy to do. You can get really creative with these and uh, really spice up your edits as a pro slash amateur videographer. Uh, so if you really like this tutorial, please click subscribe to see more like it, and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.